والسلام على سيدنا محمد وعلى آله الطيبين الطاهرين السلام عليكم brothers and sisters Tonight I will be talking to you about the sacred month of Muharram and why the Imam Hussein alayhi salam went to Karbala to fight the evil tyrant Yazid ibn Muawiyah la'anallahu it's been almost 50 years since the death of the Prophet Muhammad and the Arabian Empire was slowly getting corrupt under a tyrant named Yazid ibn Muawiyah. Imam Hussein, the grandson of the Prophet Muhammad, fought against Yazid. While Yazid was feared and despised throughout the Arabian Peninsula, Imam Hussein was admired and respected by his companions. Knowing this, Yazid decided he would make an agreement with Imam Hussein, hoping to gain some form of legitimacy for his tyrannical rule. Imam Hussein had a choice to make to support Yazid, which would mean a big reward and a life of luxury, or to refuse, which might lead to war against Imam Hussein and his followers. For Imam Hussein, the choice between the easy thing and the right thing wasn't the choice at all. Imam Hussein refused and said, I will never give Yazid my hand like a man who has been humiliated, nor will I flee like a slave. I have not risen to spread evil or to show off. I only desire to enjoy good values and prevent evil. Imam Hussein salam, refused to give it to injustice and saw it his duty as an imam to defend and protect the future of Islam and the next generation of Muslims. When the Prophet Muhammad وسلم, and his family joined Imam Hussein, he was distrusted by the Arabian Empire and were kicked out of their homes. Although Imam Hussein salam, only had an army of 72 men and was accompanied by his women and children, Yazid still sent an army of thousands of men to kill Imam Hussein salam, and all those that defended him for the sake of Islam. The martyrdom of Imam Hussein was a sad time for Muslims. And to this day, we try to feel the pain of the Muslims at Karbala by pounding our chests. Truly, the sacrifice of Imam Hussein for the future of Islam was not in vain. As India's famous movement leader, Mahatma Gandhi, once said, I learned from Hussein how to be wronged and be a winner. I learned from Hussein how to attain victory while being oppressed. So Imam Hussein's revolution against tyranny is a shining example for all human beings to look up to. And although he was killed in battle, his spirit lives on forever in our conscience. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Oh,